I destroyed a lot of things through my addiction. And overcoming that addiction was the toughest thing I've ever done in my life. Much, much harder than paralysis. Much harder than paralysis. So before my first accident, I had not touched any type of drug. I was this straight and narrow kid. When I was discharged from the hospital, LDS hospital back in 06, they sent me home with a drug called Oxycontin. And I didn't know about this drug. All I knew is that it took my pain away and I didn't want to be in pain. And I knew that I, I would take this drug before I did therapies so that I could push my body hard and, and I became an addict. And I abused pain medication for five years and, and I'm very much an addict still today. Up until my second accident, I hadn't touched a opiate in eight years. And after my for the second accident, my biggest fear was uh, to get addicted again and, and to have that power over me. And I think it would take another addict to understand what I'm gonna say next. You know, as soon as they gave me that drip, it was, it was just saying hi to an old friend. And I didn't, I didn't, um, I'm not strong enough to beat it, not on my own. And, um, and I know that. When it comes to pain, pain lets you know you're alive. And so many times we try to get away from pain. We, we, we don't want to be in pain. And I, I just believe we do the most growth through pain. And if, I, if I'm so, so medicated that I, I push myself where I hurt myself and I don't know that I'm hurting myself because I'm so medicated then the pain pill isn't serving me so pain's my friend pain lets me know when I when I have more to give pain lets me know when I need to back off pain lets me know I'm alive